Hello, this is Chris Menard. Microsoft Word with an Office 365 subscription has a brand new feature that just came out last week. Uh, this is April 2019. So I have a document pulled up. I've got random text in it. So it doesn't matter what text is in your document. I'm going to go to the View tab up at the top. After I select View, I have a command called Learning Tools. I'm going to select Learning Tools and a new contextual tab called Learning Tools appears at the top. This is really cool. I'm going to change the line focus because I want to read through this document, but I don't want to read the whole document. I'm going to go three lines. So now it's showing me just three lines of text at a time. When I scroll down with the mouse, I'm going to do the scroll wheel just one time, it'll pick the next three lines. So I've read this, it looks good, down scroll wheel, or if you want to come over here and click, you can, but it keeps going three lines at a time because notice it stops at document coordinated period, and then it goes to when you click, I'm going to click one time, and there's document coordinated, so it keeps jumping three lines. If you want to change it to five lines, you can. And they even have one line. I'm going to turn that to none for just a second. Also, inside of the Learning Tools contextual tab, you can change the column width. Changing the column width here does not change the width of the document. It's just here in Learning Tools. So I'm going to go narrow. Just to prove it, I'm going to close Learning Tools. My document's still the same width it was. So let me go back in there, View, Learning Tools, and I'm gonna even make it very narrow. And I can still change, I can change the page color, if you wanna change the page color. You can also change the text spacing. And you can also show the breakdown between your syllables. If I press that, you can see that there are dots in there. Let me zoom in just a tad. <clears throat> Look at the word example, for, as you see on the screen. Also the word design, so it's working. I'm going to turn that one off. And finally, you can have the document read aloud to you. If I hit read aloud. When you click design and choose a new theme, the pictures, charts, and smart art graphics change to match. I'll pause. You can change the speaker if you want to. Your new theme. When you apply styles, your heading. There you go. So that is Learning Tools. It is contextual tab. You get there by going to View, Learning Tools. Thank you for your time. Thank you for your time. Feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel. I appreciate your support and have a great day.